or that we were missing last time. There's a map to this area that would really help us find the item because it shows you where it is, but uh, I don't think we're going to be able to find it. I don't even know if there is a map that exists to this area. So. There's even a boss fight for this area. It's a very small one, but there is one. I always felt like maybe this was the area with the extra collectible that we missed, but it doesn't look like it. Yeah, and once we actually we can come up here once we've gone down. At the same time, I kind of I kind of just want to find it. I want to find the collectible. I don't want it, I don't want to need to go back up here. These are unbreakable. It's unbreakable as well. Rats. I don't think we can cut through these. Yep. The answer is no, chat. The <laughs> Thanks for the great stream and the positive vibes. Of course, Dean. Thank you for the positive vibes and thank you for the donation. That is a humongous support. Yes, thank you so, so much. I actually heard this donation because there wasn't a ridiculously loud um, thing going on. Alright, we need to make sure we kill this thing before it sees us. Got it. Uh, we're also going to go grab this upgrade. I think this gives us... Oh yeah, the reflection. This is kind of the least useful... Uh, <laughs> the least useful... Upgrade. That's okay. Wait, they didn't cut that? What the hell? Okay. That's strange. Normally that gets cut immediately by any shot that we should fire. However can I make it to the week on the weekly top? It should update pretty soon. Yeah, there you go. Hmm. Looks like the size of it actually auto increases, which presents a weird problem. It, they they start overlapping without. There's no way we can make it smaller. One second. I actually might try and fix this right now. Um, now that we know what goes down. <laughs> So give me a second. Not that it all influences my tip. <laughs> of course not. What do you mean? <laughs> uh... All right, that should fix it. Um, I've set the limit to being three. So that now it shouldn't go anymore. It shouldn't grow any more than that. Yeah, that seems like a good a good solution. That's cool. You can move it. Yeah, of course I can move. It. What do you mean? I can move my face as well. Look, I am now the gun. The gun is me. <laughs> but yeah, I can move anything. I am all powerful. I am in control of this stream. <laughs> uh. Yeah, that, that seems like a good solution to me. Gonna lock it at three. Whoa! This deserves a pog champ, Steen. I know you're still learning the Twitch lingo. Perks of being a wallflower. You're not a wallflower. Why would you say that? Okay. Oh, okay. This is where the battle is. 
This is where the things start trying to attack me. We do need a place to recharge our stuff. There's also a shotgun down here, uh, which we're going to get out as our secondary. But it's only a double barrel shotgun, so it's not very effective until these things get at close range. Deserves a what? It's kind of like it's kind of like Bible thump. It's a a pog champ. Like whoa, that's so cool. Or Kappa. All right, here this thing is. And there's actually quite a few of these things, so we need to be careful. Comes another one. We're just gonna bait them out and one by one kill them with our shotgun. Kappa is overused. Oops, I meant streamer. I mean streamer. Yes, that's true. I'm somewhat of a wallflower and a streamer if if you think about it. Because I'm a small streamer. Oh, we got that one in one shot. Nice. Be a couple more. I think that one's going to come down here as well. Let's try and kill this one with our laser craft work. I think that did it. Yeah, I heard it crack. A wall streamer. That's right. No, I'm a green screen. I'm a green streamer. I use a green screen, not a wall. Don't be ridiculous, Dean. Don't be ridiculous. Ooh, I got the sniffles. I have I've been I've had quite the cold recently. It's been quite the adventure. Let's keep our shotgun out for now. Because I like using the shotgun. It is cool. Grab some health, not that we really need it. But I did want to jump over here to try and make sure there weren't any collectibles we were missing. Oh yes, me too. Yeah. <laughs> you you always get timed out for the symbols. I'm actually gonna increase the symbols because I think that's like the second or third time you've uh you've been timed out for symbols. So give me another second while I again adjust adjust things. This should only take like five minutes. Not even five minutes. That's quite the punishment. What do you mean? It's just a it's just a timeout. A really brief timeout. Symbols can be really annoying when people spawn um spam like 30 or 40 of them, you know, especially if they're not just dots. I'll up it to like 35 symbols. That seems like a good amount. Why is it letting you now? It's not letting you do anything. I don't see any symbols. It was all the periods you put. <laughs> Better be careful, it's gonna get you. How many did you put? I just updated it, so it, it shouldn't be it shouldn't be too many. By the way, you're no longer timed out in the room, so you You should be fine. You you can speak. You have my authority to speak. But it sounds like there's more of these robots in here as well. Testing the system gone wrong. She's turned into Max! <laughs> Testing the system. <laughs> I know, you got that 10 minute ban. So we actually tried jumping down here last time and it definitely did not work. You 100% you die if you jump down there. <laughs> That's the worst you've ever gotten. Yeah. 
It, luckily now it's up to 35 symbols, so there's no situation in which anyone should ever put 35 signal symbols without trying to maliciously spam. Uh, so, should be all good. But that's also why Nightbot warns you, right? It just timed you out the first time. Um, and that way, you should never have a problem, if that makes sense. BRB. All right. See you in a bit, Steen. See you in a bit. All right. So I think this is the overall way we need to go. Yeah, it is. Down here, there's another boss room. So we're going to go back here and go into that room that we just missed to make sure we're not missing anything. I hate the ladders in this game. I hate the ladders in this game. They're so confusing sometimes. It's not that they're confusing in how they work. It's just the way they work is kind of dumb a little bit. Kind of dumb a little bit. Oh, we can't get in there yet. Ooh. It looks like we can somehow... Shoot this. With the reflecting laser craft work? Not through there. Maybe like up? No. There's definitely a way to do it though. That's strange. Oh, weird. How do we get down there? This is definitely what we missed last time. Definitely, definitely. Can we not bust this box open? Yeah, you do like the warning. No, we can't we can't bust it open. Interesting. We keep accidentally. <laughs> we should have the reflecting thing now, so it shouldn't be a problem to... I was thinking maybe they want us to bounce it off this, but it doesn't look like it. There definitely is a way to get in here, though. Very strange. Wait, no way. They want us to jump into this? This is the most awesome secret ever. Now the question is, can we actually make the jump? Yes, we can. <laughs> That's so cool. Jasper was actually right. He didn't lie to us for once. Go ahead and give this a quick recharge. Nice! Cool. Now the question is, what is down here that's so cool that it needed to have such a weird secret entrance? It has to be something, right? It has to be something. I think maybe we jump from right here? Yeah, that's what it looks like. No oh, shit. Hmm, that's odd. Doesn't like us jumping from there. We definitely need to go up there, though. That is the... We found it! 
the true treasure. We're gonna spam that sound for now on. We got it. So that means we have everything on this level except this one person. Which I don't. I'm thinking that must be Tekla because we've already gotten the the player portraits for everyone else in this area. Oh, we can get up here. Nice. But I don't think it really does anything. There's no reason for us to get up here. Except to be cool and be up here. Which is all the reason we need. Alright, cool. Wow, that was that was a super cool one. I approve. That has the isosceles triangle seal of approval now. Yeah, some of the hidden areas in this game are really hard to find actually. It's like surprisingly hard. And we completely missed them on the way back, on the way through the first time. Which is something that I've really been enjoying about this second playthrough, is we've been able to find all the creepy, weird areas. Alright, so we need, still need to get that piece of moldy concrete. And that's where we're currently going towards. Cool. We're back. Boop! I have a kind of hurt. Thanks, guys. I thought they didn't try and help me at all. I'm just like locked down in the sewers and they do absolutely nothing. What the damn hell are you doing? Science project. Are you scaring Max? Oh. Sorry, pal. Didn't know we'd flip out like that. Is that his son? No. Well, kind of. I don't know. So not his son. Used to be Klaus had a son, born during the war. A miracle, he called it. So he had tried for years to have a child, him and his wife. Yeah, well, he'd make a pretty good father for a Nazi. The for a Nazi. Was born with a club foot. Klaus knew, of course, what that meant. He begged the doctors not to report it to the authorities. Then secret police showed up to take the boy away. Klaus and his wife tried to stop them. So wife died from a bullet to the head. The child too. Klaus. So sad. So sad. So he blames himself. I think so. And he will never forgive the Nazis. Never forgive the Nazis. Got us a piece of moldy concrete. Actually, it's specifically it's moldy super it was super concrete. All right, there should be a collectible here now. Yep. The same one is always here at that exact location. Well, I found you. Oh shit, there's a bunch of lost toys in here. Let's go find all of these. That sounds like a great side quest. I'm guessing they're for Max Hoss. Um, I didn't even realize that this was a quest at this point. I'm back! Nice, Dean. How are, how are you? We're currently trying to complete a quest to find all of the lost toys for Max Hoss. The gentle, um, giant. See, if you look in the top left corner, right above me, um, you'll see that there's a robot checked off. And then there's three other toys that have not been found. So we're going to search everywhere. Through hell and high water. Oh, I hear, I hear the music box somewhere. There's a truck. I'm sleepy and accidentally ate a whole bag of chips. <laughs> That's okay. Eating a whole bag of chips is good sometimes, right? Oh, I hear the sound. Where is it? Don't want to talk to her yet because I'd close out the quest. We want to find... Oh! There's one last thing, the music box. Oh, she's lifting weights, that's cool. Wait, what? Where is it? It's giving me an indicator like I can, like I can pick it up. I want to actually see it before I pick it up. The hell? This is turning into some kind of compulsive behavior. 
We flushed every. Oh, there they are. We flushed every toilet like ten times, and now he's like, "This is turning into some kind of compulsive behavior." Apparently, he doesn't like flushing toilets as much as we do. I'll get you home. Nice. Okay, let's go take these to Max. We can just go up through here, I think. We just squeezed our seven-foot-tall Adonis body through a six-inch. Great in the wall, somehow. What is that? What do we just get an indicator for? Oh, we can... We can fix this light bulb. Aren't we quite the handyman? Alright. Let's go talk to Max Haas real quick. Maybe this is the character model we haven't gotten yet. Huh, I hear that music again. That's Max's music box. Oh, there it is right there. Wait, where do we put them? Oh. <clears throat> Putting all his toys down. We are the we're the best Nazi killer killer wonderful person in the world. Good dreams, Max. Max is so sweet. He has kind of a similar head injury to that we do. Except yeah, that was nice. Okay, that that was the character model that we hadn't gotten. So that means we've gotten every single um, character model for this this level, which is nice. I mean, every single collectible for this level, which is awesome. There's not much known about Max except his name and that he doesn't like violence. He was found by Klaus hiding behind some dump dumpsters in an alley. Klaus has taken care of Max ever since. Yeah, the Nazis kill anyone that's disabled, and so um, in order to save his life. Klaus probably had to bring him here. What's that sound? I think that was Fergus snoring. Yeah, a bit cathartic. I agree. <laughs> that should be all of our all of our quests. Let's go talk to the lady real quick if we can find her. Not our lady, the other lady. There she is. Can't talk to her. Okay. Let's talk to our lady. Hey, our lady. Thank you, William. Give me some time to analyze this. I think I'm onto something. Gum. It's good. If you're the type of person to eat your feelings, that is. Yeah. Nah. I'm good, thanks. Fergus. Do that concrete. The essential building material of the Reich. It's based on a Dot Yishud technology. It's almost perfect, but it's deteriorating through time, developing mold. Someone is tempering with the mix. Someone, Someone being our good friend that we're gonna break out of prison. It it's part of the Dot Yishud. Type of limestone that exists only in northern Croatia. Now, look at this. The yes, the game is pretty quiet. Roth. It appears three times in Dot Yishud documents. According to official records, Let me know if this changes the volume. In Woj, Did the volume just go up? A forced labor camp in Belice, in northern Croatia. Now, this is where things get interesting. The labor camp excavates limestone from a quarry for manufacture of Ubekon. If it didn't go up, let me know because I, I believe there's two separate volume mixers I have to deal with. Said Roth, a living member of Dot Egypt. Dot Egypt. There are so many mm, no, not quite. Not noticeably. Man. Okay. Chances are he's dead already. We can't assault a site of this magnitude. I'll turn up the in-game volume when I get the chance. Not the army arrives. What is the plan? Someone needs to go in there and find him. Go undercover. <laughs> Any volunteers? Undercover. You ready for this, Blaskovich? I always get volunteered so to do the dumb things, and this is the one part that he uh, that he acknowledges it. Ready for something like 